Hello there, fellow humans. Today, we're gonna be checking out a new old school hardcore MMORPG called Ethereal Echoes of Yore. We're gonna be playing it for a little bit. I'm gonna give you my first thoughts on it and let's jump into the world of Ethereal. Here we are. Let's make a new character. Can we be a bald? Nope. Oh, minus points for that. Can okay, we have it just a mustache? Oh, wow. Kind of just like being naked. Put the wraps on the legs and we're good. You're about to choose your starting vocation with Ethereal. On the next screen, you will be able to read about each starting vocation as well as potential ascension path. So, we have a choices here. Fighters, protectors, archers, rogues, arcanists, and mystics. Hmm, I wonder which one I'm gonna pick. Tell me in the comments if you know. So, I guess these are the paths you can take. A demon knight. That sounds really cool. I, why archers can only be hunters and rangers? Same goes for rogues. Only assassins and shadow blade. And guardians. Earth guard, dragon knight, demon knight. The mystics can be enhancer, beast, cultist, and druid. I like the sound of cultist. No necromancer here. So that would be other choice I would go for. But choice is kind of obvious here. We're gonna go for archer. Then we can read more about them. So let's see what the difference is between hunter and ranger. Hunter, a mastery of the bow. Makes you dangerous from afar. It's more bow focused and has grenades. How about ranger? Spirits allow to infuse powerful nature magic. You're gonna have some support skills. And you're gonna have a spiritual companion. Hunter is my my class for sure. I mean, just looking at the picture here, it's uh, it's definitely my class. Okay, we're in the game. Gonna move with the WASD. Got a quick bar. Got a journal. Okay. Find an NPC to strike up a conversation. Okay. Let me talk with this guy. Learn to how to gather resources. Let's get started, shall we? Yes. I like the way the uh, the text comes up. It's pretty cool. Gather ten items. Oh, there we got a bush. We can right click it and then use. Need three more, three more berries. So I can do a control click and it's gonna automatically gather. That's pretty nice. Okay, we got the quest done. Return the quest giver, complete the task. Hello, welcome back. Yes, I got the berries for you. Next step is cooking. Innkeeper. Yes, I'm gonna learn about cooking. Thank you. Oh, we got a couple new blueprints. A chicken chowder. We gotta cook this one. So control click, you can actually open the door. That's pretty handy. So we gotta pick chicken chowder here. It will tell me what we need. And we're gonna fill it. And we can craft it. Seems to have gotten the hang of it. How about you do me a favor? Yes, I'm interested. Let's go. There will be no dangers. Oh, we're gonna get killed. Can already feel it. Can we put this one into the bar? Yeah. Increase intelligence by 5. Casting speed by 5%. Oh, nice. It's a buff food. You actually need to eat food. That's like a fill bar. I have a feeling there's gonna be some enemies here. Like a rat. Can you turn? Oh, you can turn the cam in this. That's cool. Equip a torch. Oh, we need to we need to equip it. I dropped it. Oh no. I didn't mean to drop it. Can I pick it up? No. Oh well, that's that's bad. Let's see if we can find another one. Oh, okay. We got a lantern now. Great. Head down, kill at least three of them. Head into the kitchen and open the trap door. We gotta go kill some rats. Here we are. Let's see how is the how is the combat. Nothing too exciting, I guess. You gotta use skills. They do quite a, little, a lot of damage. Definitely feels like like a runescape. A little bit. Nothing too fancy here. You take quite a bit of damage. So I think yeah, this one we can use to rest. So we can sit down. Get some health back. And we gotta kill one more rat. Then we're done here. Oh, there's a chest here. It's locked. Oh no. Okay, we got a couple of ra more rats here. We just need to kill one more. Then we're done. Oh, the rats are attacking me. Oh gosh. The rats are trying to kill me. I think we got it though. Got some meat out of these. I wonder if we can cook some rat meat. Get some food. Probably. Kind of dying here though. Hey, we got his... Uh, we got some items for him. Or her. Dustin, okay. I added them to your inbox. Here is some hemp fiber. You can open and own personal repair window. You can use NPCs to repair. So he wants me to repair some gloves. So Alt U to repair. Then we drag it here. How do we put it in? Oh, there we go. We got the hemp fiber. Repair. You're not a near re crafting station that you can repair items. Oh, okay. I, I don't think I'm a big fan of the movement. Like the four uh, directional movement. Feels a bit weird to me. Okay. Now we can repair. Nice. We got gloves. 
Use the rest skill and then head to the ship in the harbor. I think the question is gonna be, would I play this game over RuneScape? Congratulations, Hunter. You complete the tutorial and before leaving Solitary Isle, you get one more ability to use in your adventures. Choose one. There's only one option. Piercing shot. Okay. Thank you. Okay, so now I guess now the game opens up a little bit. Okay, is it gonna give me uh, some kind of quest here? Grab a few bottles. Well, let's go. Oh, it's here already. Great. They told me you would come. Yes. What? Did he kill me? The dude just smacked me in the face. So rude. It gave me a potion though. I can use that one. Oh, there's gonna be some enemies here. More spiders. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We're gonna die. No. I'm out. Woo. That was close. Did we survive? I think I survived. Good, good, good. Sorry about that. Bottles. We need the bottles. Trap door. Maybe the bottles are at the uh here. Oh, these biters are brutal. Am I supposed to be like able to kill these? Use the ladder. We out. Again. Maybe I need to get some uh, like levels or something. Biters are brutal. Oh I need the uh, the bottles from here. Okay, we got it. Gotta read the quests. That's why he smacked me in the waist face because I didn't have the bottles for him. I got the bottles now. Yes, they are for you. We need to go to the attic now, I think. The spiders kill me. They hurt. Are you going to the attic? Yes, I'm going to the attic. I definitely like the fact that you can move your uh, camera around. I wasn't sure if you were able to, but... The game actually looks cool. Like, I, I quite like the aesthetics, but... I'm just not a big on the movement. I, I feel It feels a bit clunky. Yeah, I can't do this. They kill me. The spiders hit way too hard. We need a better weapon or something. I wanna get some levels. Can't kill the spiders in the attic. Unless I get some uh, XP here. We got level 2. Let's go. Maybe there's some other quests we can do. Hey, maybe this guy has some quests for me. Yes. Thank you. Use the rope to climb down. Gather one. So we gotta use the rope to get to the uh, the rat nest. Is this the rat cave? I can kill these rats. They make a weird noise when you kill them. Oh no, there's some spiders here. Oh, these are pretty weak spiders. Yeah, we gotta we gotta find this guy's lunch here. What's in here? I need a better bow. Oh, that's a big spider. Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 we're not gonna go there. There's another one. No, did that just spawn? Oh, we're kind of dying here. We need to rest a little bit. And we're good to go again. Oh, now I'm getting ganked. I don't want to die. Come on, come on, come on. I can do it, I believe. Yes, I got it. Wow, that was close. This is a really hard quest we, we're doing here. I'm struggling. A lot. Feels very uh, old school to me. I do like the struggle. I, I just don't like the movement in this game. I think I, I would like everything else except the movement and the combat. That's gonna be the biggest no-no's for me when it comes to this game. One fat rat. You have the biggest of rats you find. Nestor's lunch. Okay, so we gotta find a big rat. Oh, but we already got it. We, we got it. Now we have to go back to the uh, Nestor. Okay, let's go. And here we are, back at Nestor. Let's see, I'm really curious what do we get as a reward. Yes, I found your lunch. Ooh, 9 DPS bow. Damn, that's really good. Feels like you're getting rewarded quite a bit. That's awesome. Oh, I think now we can do the uh, the addict quest because uh, we got a better bow. Let's go try it out. Ooh, look at the damage. It's so good now. It's gonna be so easy. Time to die, spiders. These ones are still brutal. Holy crap. Wow. At least we killed one now, so we can go back and kill the other one. Just gotta heal up. Okay, let's get it. Well, it's a bit easier now that there's only one left. 
Oh yeah. The bow makes a difference. Nice. Ooh, we got one shot it. Nice. Uh, select one reward. I'm gonna take these legs. The great sword looked awful. Okay, we're gonna tell this guy what we picked. Hey, we got 100 XP from that. Nice. Go northwest through the forest. Find guardsman Karoti. But hey, we got better pants. Are they visually changing? Oh, they do. That's nice. I think this guy might buy items. We can we can check it out. No, we can't sell anything to this guy. Oh, sell. I can only sell this torch. You have nothing to sell to this vendor. Oh. So maybe there's another vendors that can buy different items. That's the case. That's that's pretty interesting. I like that. Oh, this guy tells me about the um the craftsman. Let's go see if there's any vendors in this place. Have a good day. Doesn't have a quest for me. That's fine. There's a weapon merchant here. Let's see if this guy buys my weapons. I have nothing to sell to this vendor. Wow, the best bow you can buy is a uh, 5.7. And we got like a 10.1 DPS bow. That's wild. What does this guy want to sell? Oh, this guy wants to buy all my items. Awesome. We're gonna sell... Oh, those are not worth anything. These are actually worth something. Rap meat is worth nothing. Spider meat is also worth nothing. These are worth something. I can sell all these. We gotta find some quests to do. Well, we can do the uh, the hunter's prey quest now. We're like pretty close to that, so. Oh, there's some random hunt hunter here. Are these like the... Oh yeah, I think my class was called hunter. Professions. Skinning. We can do skinning. In wolves. I mean, sure. Cole Wayne. Might be finding a copper somewhere in here, too. Try to mine these. Oh, he's mining with me. No, I got hit by the rat. Wow. So rude. Hey, there's some NPC here. Let's see if he has a quest for me. Will you help me with the something? Yes, I will help you. I do like the uh, kind of a... Uh, Exploration. I think that's really good. So he wants to me map the aisle. We have to find data for this guy. Okay. Yeah, I like the feeling of exploration where you like really, really like trying to search for things. I think a lot of the uh, the modern MMOs are really missing that kind of feeling. It's a little bit shame that I'm not too big on the combat and the movement. Because I think uh, everything else in this game would kind of uh, hit the spot for me. Whoa, that's a big wolf. Okay, let's kill it. Okay, so how do we... how do we skin the wolf, though? Oh, there we go. So we click the, the knife and then we hit the uh, the body or the carcass and it will skin. Oh, there's more wolves here, too. Cubs. Oh, we're killing the cubs. Cubs need to die. I wonder if this game is a taming on it. Okay, so you can use it in the bar. That's great. Very convenient. We need two more wolves and then we're done with that. Why are these wolves so big? I feel like they, they could kill you, but I think my bow is just so good now. Level 4. Now we just go back. We gotta tan the hide into leather. Oh, there's the tannery. Okay, we gotta use this thingy. How does one use it? Tanning rag? Oh, I have to wait it out. Hey. Then I have to split it up and uh, put it on multiple ones. Can it do like all five at the same time? In one pelt you get three leathers. Oh, okay. I actually don't know if they can loot. Like that guy looked at it, but I don't think they can loot my uh, my stuff. We got it. We got the leather. Now we can craft the helmet. At least you get three from a single pelt, so it's kind of nice. Leather cap, try fill. Let's craft it. I like the crafting animation with the hammer. It's pretty cool. Very simple. Gonna give me some nice money. Good looking cap. I take those. Here's your 60 copper. Thank you. We got a basics of leatherworking too. Do we use that? Like what do we do? A small water skin. Did I craft one for myself too? Oh, well here we go. Oh wow, look at that. You needed quite a bit to craft that. It's a nice chest piece. Good luck. That was the actual quest we needed to do. So we have to collect 10 rabbit meat. 
Okay, now we got all the leather. Let's craft this piece. Let's do a uh, chest piece. So much better what I have. Boom. We got it. Looking good. Okay, I think that's a good uh, stopping point for me. I like a couple things in this game, but I don't think I can get past the uh, the movement and the combat. It's uh, it's a bit too clunky for me. I love the music. The music is really good. Love the aesthetics. I love how the questing actually feels rewarding. Get items that increase your power. It has a very old school feeling. Feels a lot like RuneScape, which is a good thing to me. I do like the exploration uh, nature of questing where I just have to go around and look for quests. It doesn't really tell me where to go. I like that. Yeah, sadly, I think the uh, the combat is just the killer here. And the movement. Yeah, I had a fun for a couple of hours. Probably not gonna continue this one. Thanks for watching, people. Hit that like button if you enjoyed this content. Don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more MMORPG videos. I hope you have a good one. Take care. Bye-bye.